An essential part of the Real Housewives of New Jersey is Teresa Jadis the last. Original cast member since the show's debut in 2009, Teresa has been a fixture. On fan televisions, Teresa has given her everything to the program, not only in each season, but throughout her whole life. Teresa has always been honest. Through the good, the terrible, and the ugly throughout the course of the program, she has given birth separated from her parents, served time in jail, got married again, changed homes, battled, and experienced love. It's undeniable that fans have witnessed the highs and lows of Teresa's life, and they still yearn to see more, whether it's through her renowned onliners' fashion statements or her lovely bond with her daughters or through the infamous table, flipping her drama with her sister-in-law or the drama among the current cast in evidence of Bravo's dependence on Teresa Judas. Draw viewers' production even stopped filming Real Housewives of New Jersey. While Teresa was incarcerata, it's the pudding that makes the the real Housewives of New Jersey would have shot if they had believed they could do so. While she was incarcerated, Teresa is not just the star of New Jersey, but she also made her Dancing with the Stars debut in the upcoming October debut of House of Villains Season 2. She will also play a prominent role in the cast. Super Bowl advertisements have even included Teresa because of her contributions on The Real Housewives of New Jersey. Teresa has siempre had a full schedule. Teresa is not only a pleasure to behold, but her wild side and her willingness to get her hands filthy are what really set her apart considering how split up the cast was in season 14. The Real Housewives of New Jersey may have had its most costly season to date. Jennifer Iden sat with Jack Gold, Schneider and Dolores Catania at Teresa's side of the table Margaret. Joseph's Rachel Fuda Danielle Cabral and Melissa Gorga are on the opposing side. This splintered group has one thing in common though Teresa Judas despite the fact that this is the worst cast divide this program has ever seen, although a, a Melissa Margaret and Rachel asserts that they despise Teresa and would rather have no contact with her practically. Every scene in season 14 revolves on Teresa Teresa dominated their conversation during their indoor tennis. Matches Teresa wasn't even physical. Present at Melissa's house party, yet she still managed to elicit a response from the guests since Melissa was the topic. Of conversation, Teresa is still being discussed by this cast on social media. She is vacationing, traveling, and putting her daughter Melania Judas in college while leading the life of her dreams, despite the fact that half of the cast detests Teresa, she was the talk of the season Teresa Judas is the only cast. Member from New Jersey, if not the whole, franchise who has ever achieved such iconic status in addition to her fair share of awkward moments on the program. Teresa also shares many real moments with her family, particularly with her Parents and kids from preparing sauce, with Nano and Nono to filming her. Daughter's first day of school and all. The family events in between, Teresa has. Consistently demonstrated grace and respect for her parents and Italian. Heritage as she and her ex-husband Joe. Judas were sent to prison. Teresa even succeeded in keeping her family together. Among the most touching moments in the, the entire series is the scene in Season 7, where Teresa eventually returns home. Teresa is the one who brings emotion to a lot performance. It doesn't matter if the viewers love her or hate her. Yes, Teresa has taken part in a lot of the altercations on The Real Housewives of N. New Jersey. There have been several. Well-known fights between Teresa and Danielle Stab Caroline Manzo Kathy Wacky and even Jacqueline Lorita Bravo cannot afford for Teresa Judas to leave the program which is the primary distinction between her and all these other ladies. Viewers have witnessed some of the most painful moments involving Teresa and Melissa Teresa and Joe Gorga her own. 
brothers, and even Teresa and Margaret. Teresa now provides a narrative for each of these individuals every time they go. Have Melissa and Joe Gorga bring up Teresa, even Rachel and John Fuda. Mention Teresa in every episode as Margaret is always scheming to harm her and talking about her endlessly. Podcasts and social media. What topics? Would the Real Housewives of New Jersey discuss if Teresa were to go from the show without that there would be no entertainment and the number of views would undoubtedly decline even if Teresa is portrayed as the antagonist, the antagonist may occasionally steal the show. New Jersey is Teresa Judas. She has created many memories and provided amusement. Will go down in reality television. History as the most notorious scenes in. In addition to being the only original member still alive, Teresa has demonstrated her strength as a mother.